Right, we've got this shelf in the kitchen. Um, it's kind of a um, consequence of redoing the roof in the other room um, because we had to put a support beam across the entrance where the kitchen to help support that roof. And it seemed a shame just to have like a solid board in ducking in, so we put a shelf up. But I never really got round to finishing it. Um, first things first is we need to get rid of everything off the shelf. So the re we're starting with the top piece, and the reason being is when we put the side pieces in, they can hold the edge up, and the back piece will hold the back edge up. And we've got this nice gluing surface because I don't want any fixings to show, so we're just going to glue everything. And I think the only thing that I've really got to work around with these two cables here, um, and just leave like a little cutout so there's going to be a little junkie box in here. In case you ever want to change the type of light that's under in this room. Uh, I might even do templates for these side pieces. Okay, this template goes, uh, I use this brown craft paper. Sure, there we go. Now, and most importantly, you want to label that this is the left side. Left and the top. Yeah, we're just going to cut all this extra foam down. Nice, And dress on the edge of the black and try and the wall. Okay, now that's all trimmed and cut. And we're going to polyfill it in. Now we have to mix the polyfiller up. So, and I say polyfiller, every time I say polyfiller, I'm in uh, all purpose powder filler. Okay, so for mixing polyfiller, this stuff, uh, these mini flexi tubs are amazing. Um, they're so easy to clean out, and uh, easy to mix in, and they're a bit more robust than like using an old takeaway tub or whatever. So it's definitely worth spending like three quid and getting one of these. Cool, now all we've got to do is wait for this to go off. Uh, if it goes off before the end of the week, uh, you'll see it. And if it doesn't, then I'm going to leave it here. All we're going to do is give it a quick sand and a quick coat of blue, and then it'll blend in really nicely. And the last bit I need to do is cut these couple of things over there. And that will be better once at least the edges are off. And then it'll all be done.